Food Truck Phil here from Taylor Hyundai of Perrysburg. I'm here with Lori Schoen, the head of Unruly Arts. Lori, if you could tell us a little bit about the organization and what you guys are all about. Sure. We are a little nonprofit art studio here at the Theater Botanical Gardens for artists with disabilities. Uh, we've been here since uh, January of 2017. We've got um, about 22 artists that currently work uh, at the studio or at home because of COVID. Um, we make incredible artwork. The artists get a great percentage of original work that they sell and then anything else they sell, they also get a percentage. All proceeds support our program. Um, we have been really grateful for the community support, especially the Taylor Hyundai and the Barones. Uh, we have just amazing community support and always can use more. Unruly Art Studio is a place of connection and co-creation and time spent with the artists reminds us all to fall in love with the process and let go of the end product. The artists work in a variety of mediums including painting, drawing, glass, ceramics, and even fiber arts. They believe that the perspective comes through the art itself or by participating in the process. Unruly Arts is not affiliated with a government agency or large organization which allows them total freedom and independence. They rely solely on community support and donations to supply the artists with materials and provide the services they absolutely need. You have an opportunity right now, before it's too late, to donate to a local organization that needs our help to continue providing resources to those unruly artists that need freedom from the restrictions that tamper the human spirit. Click on the link below right now and show your support today. Um, I'm working on a hippo and a donkey. Wow. Look at that. Hi, my name is Shana and I'm working on a sugar skull here. Um, this is going to be put up on our side building over here. And I'm currently outlining it with a sharpie marker. And I'm working with acrylics too as well. 